Hi, this is Anne. I'm one of the librarians here at Randall Library, and I'm going to walk you through the process of searching for books and videos. And if you want to learn how to actually find them in the library or request them if we don't have them, then you can view another tutorial called Finding Books and Videos. So first thing you want to do is be sure you're on the library's website. So it's library.uncw.edu, and then you can use these search tabs going across the main part of the screen. So if you're looking for videos, click on the videos tab. If you're looking for books, click on books and more. And you'll hear your instructors and librarians sometimes say search the library catalog. The library catalog is basically like a search engine that searches through our books and our videos. So that's what we're talking about when we say the catalog. And here is our search box here. I can search by keyword, I can search by title, author, and I can even look to see if we have a specific journal. So this is sort of a basic search here. You can also go to advanced and it gives you some more options here. So you have the same choices, so author and title, um, and you can combine keywords. So let's say I want to look for children and media. I can type that in. And then you have some other options too. One of them is to be able to search what we call the consortium, and that's essentially three different schools collections. So we've got UNC Wilmington, UNC Pembroke, and Fayetteville State University. I'm going to leave that as Wilmington for right now and we'll come back to it. And then you can search by material type. Let's say I just want books. If you want something in a specific language, you can do that. You can put in a date range. This is helpful if you're looking for something that's recent. You can specify the last few years. And there's search tips on the right that will help you too. So let's see what we get. So I got five books that are at UNCW that were published after 2010. So on the left, you'll see the little icon that tells you that they're books. On the right, you'll see status, which basically means whether or not they're on the shelf. In process means it's in the building, but it's not yet on the shelf. Available means you're good to go. That book is on the shelf. If you see a due date, that's when the book should be returning to the library. So if we look at number three, another way that you can actually search to find more things is to click on the title of a book that actually looks relevant to your search. And you'll notice that the call number is in sort of the middle of the screen. If you click that call number, you're going to see a list of other books. The way Randall Library has its books organized is by subject. So everything is grouped by subject. So when you find one book that looks good and is on your topic, you'll find a whole bunch more. So you'll see that here. I'm going to go back and also show you, you can see the table of contents for most of the books when you search. And then you'll see these subjects. Subjects are kind of like tags. So every single book that we have is being tagged about a particular subject. So for example, if you were really interested in child development, specifically in the United States, you can click on it. It shows you similar subjects and it tells you how many items that we have that were tagged as being about child development in the United States. So you could click that and then you're going to see those books. So it's just a different way to search. I'm going to go back to the library homepage for just a second and I'm going to click on books and more. So we're back to our basic search here. Uh, let's go back to advanced and now let's use that consortium search. So I'm going to select consortium. I'm going to do the same search, children and media. And now you'll start to see books from the other schools. Here, for example, number three, this is something UNC Pembroke has. Okay, you'll see Fayetteville State too. So you actually have access to all of these books. So if you wanna learn more about how to retrieve these books from the other two schools and how to actually find books in Randall Library, you'll wanna view the tutorial called Finding Books and Videos. And as always, if you ever need any help, you can go to the library homepage and you'll see all kinds of different ways to get help right here.